The dog. A man's best friend. Aren't they super cute? I'm no dog person myself, but I still think they're cute. And if you may believe Wikipedia, they have been on humanity's side for 15 to 100,000 years already. But where am I going with this? While animal transport on planes could be a whole different video, today's topic is going to be something else entirely. What is that barking sound you hear on some planes? If you like the content, please make sure to subscribe for interesting aviation videos. Now let's get into it. Welcome to Airspace Explained. To be honest, the idea for this video came from my mother, who is a bit afraid of flying. And I must admit, the sound a plane makes during flight, or even on ground, can be a bit intimidating, if you are easily spooked. And yet, the vast majority of these sounds are as harmless as they could be. Today I'm going to explain to you what that barking sound is that you may hear during the engine start of the plane. By the way, I think the sound only exists in the A320 family, so that is the A318, 319, 320 and 321. It sounds like this. To understand where the sound is coming from, let's have a look at the A320's hydraulic system. The A320, like most other planes, uses hydraulic pressure to move the flight controls and various other components like the landing gear and flaps. To provide the highest amount of redundancy, not one, not two, but three independent hydraulic systems are installed in the plane. Each of them controls various components, and each of them is powered differently. The systems are named yellow, green and blue. The blue system is powered by an independent electric pump, while the green and yellow systems are each powered by a pump driven by one engine. The green system is powered by the left engine and the yellow system by the right one. So far so good, but does this setup bark? Yes it does. When Airbus designed the systems, they wanted to keep as much of the plane's redundancy in any case possible. So if one engine were to fail for whatever reason, one hydraulic system would not be pressurized anymore, and they wanted to avoid this. For this reason, this device was installed, a power transfer unit, in short, PTU. This PTU is, in simple terms, a two-way hydraulic motor. If one hydraulic system fails, the other system will be able to turn this hydraulic motor and in turn pressurize the other system, without having to mix the two fluid circuits. It is this PTU that makes this sound that sounds like a barking dog or someone sawing on wood. You can hear it during pushback and startup of the engines because a short test of the device is performed after one engine is started, just to make sure it actually works before the plane takes to the skies. So there you have it, that's where the odd sound is coming from. It's actually funny to hear what people think that sound is. I've heard people suggest that it is dogs down in the cargo hold, or that it is some hatch being pulled close, or various other things. And that's it already for the video today. Make sure to subscribe for weekly aviation fun facts and if you are interested, accident reports as well. See you in the next one.